great thing. Good thing in a great way. A very good morning to one and all present here. Today, I will pick up standing half of my class six days to host today's morning broadcast. It's a beautiful day to give the blessings of God. So, I welcome Aisha and Suha for the Quran recitation. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim. Bismillahi ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Ar-Rahman. Allama al-Qur'an. Khalaqa al-Insan. In the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. The most merciful taught the Quran, created man, and taught him eloquence. The sun and the moon move by precise calculation, and the stars and the trees prosperous. And the heaven he raised and imposed the balance, that do not transgress within the balance. And establish weight in justice, and do not make deficient balance. And the earth he laid for the creatures, fruits and palm trees having shelters of dates and grain having husk and scented plants. So which of the favors of your Lord would you deny? Said the Quran. Thank you, friends. Logic will take you from A to B, but imagination will take you everywhere. So for inspiring us with a thought, I welcome Raghav. Good morning to all. The talk for the day is Kindness is a free sprinkle that spreads everywhere. I repeat. The talk for the day is Kindness is a free sprinkle that spreads everywhere. Thank you. Thank you, Raga, for motivating us with the thought. Education is the transmission of civilization which improves vocabulary, imagination and areas of communication like listening, speaking, reading and writing. So now I call upon my friend Adalia for a word of the day. Good morning to all. The word of the day is benevolence. The spelling is B-E-N-E-V-O-L-E-N-C-E. -E -E. The meaning of this word is an act of kindness. A sentence using this word is, The king was known for his benevolence. I repeat, the word of the day is benevolence. The spelling is B-E-N-E-V-O-L-E-N-C-E. -E -E. The meaning of this word is an act of kindness. A sentence using this word is, The king was known for his benevolence. Thank you. Thank you, Adalia. Speech is not only about your ability to speak, but also your ability to listen and also allow other views to be heard. So now I invite Olivia and Sarah for a speech.
speak kind words and you will hear kind echoes. Good morning to one and all present here. Today, myself, Sarah Ronnie Betticard, and myself, Olivia Jessen, is going to be presenting a speech on World Kindness Day. World Kindness Day is an international observance on 13 November every year. It was introduced in 1998. It was observed in many countries including Canada, Japan, Australia, Nigeria, and United Arab Emirates. In 2009, it was first observed in Singapore. It was also observed in India and in Italy. In the UK, it was fronted by David Jamie, who co-founded Kindness Day UK. In 2010, at the request of Michael and Lloyd White, the NSW Federalization of Parents and Citizens Association wrote to the Minister of the NSW Department of Education to place this day on the NSW school calendar. Kindness has many benefits and being kind can change the world. One action of kindness towards one human being can change the world. To change the world, we all have to do is change one's life. See the host of Netflix series. Kindness plays an important role in human life for more safe and secure. So, we conclude this speech by saying, no action of kindness, no matter how small, is ever wasted. Thank you. Thank you, friends, for the informative speech. Strong serve the purpose of expressing oneself to ourselves and to others. So now, I call upon Anishri for a relaxing song. We were both young when I first saw you. I closed my eyes and the flashback starts from standing there. In the balcony of summer air. You see the lights, see the party, the ball gown. So you make your way to the crowd and say hello. Little did I know that you were Romeo, you were throwing pebbles, and my daddy said, Stay away from Julie. And I was crying at the staircase, begging you, please don't go. And I said, Romeo, take me somewhere we could be alone. I'll be waiting. All that's left to do is run. You'll be the prince and I'll be the princess. It's a love story, baby, just say yes. Whoa. Oh, oh. So I sneak out in the garden to see you. We keep quiet cause we're dead if they knew So close your eyes Escape the sound for a little while Cause you were Romeo, I was a scarlet letter And my daddy said stay away from Julie But you were everything to me I was begging you please don't go And I said Romeo take me Somewhere we could be alone I'll be waiting all that's left to do is run, you'll be the prince and I'll be the princess. It's a love story, baby, just say yes. Romeo, save me, they're trying to tell me how to feel. This love is difficult, but it is real. Don't be afraid, we'll make it out of this mess. It's a love story, baby, just say yes. Thank you, Anishri, for this beautiful song. Reading a newspaper daily keeps us aware of many things which may be important to us. In today's world, where information is power, it can also help us in many ways. So now, I invite Trini for uh, the latest news. Good morning to all. Today, I, Shreenik, the news reporter of Siddhi, stand you to say today's news. India News Jammu and Kashmir and Ladakh officially split into two union territories. India invites foreign firms to invest in state oil companies. World News Fires and greenhouse gases are drying up the Amazon rainforest. Australian bushfires reach Sydney's outskirts. Qatar News Ministry of Interior launches new Qatar visa e-portal. 
Qatar opens speak up form. Qatar visa center to open soon in Tunisia. Sports news. Barcelona uh, Barcelona ties Slavia Praha at a score of 0-0. Deepak Sahar claims double hat-trick against Bangladesh. Real Madrid defeats Galatasaray at a score of 6-0. Thank you. Thank you, Srinik, for updating us with the latest news. Mother and motherland are greater than heaven. So, to show our devotion towards our motherland, please rise up for the national anthems.